let's just go. There's no point in pondering it. I'll figure it out usually as soon as I get to the set what I was supposed to be doing here. Now there's one issue I noticed straight away. Actually, I have no lust. And I have no idea how long the boss takes without lust, Pomanda. Oh well, let's, let's just hope I get it from somewhere. I mean, there's a good chance of getting items in the last three floors anyway. I usually just blast through them with rage. The start of this set is nice, like it is in every set. Well, actually, the last set is a bit reversed, since avoiding the patrols at the start of the last set is kind of annoying. Since they're proximity based, and some of the uh, later ads you get in the last set are side based, so they're much easier to avoid. Oh, so you need to be really selective at the beginning, beginning of the last set. Whereas in the end, if you ha just have steel commanders, you can pretty much kill anything. Now, this is usually the first set where time starts to be an issue. So I kind of want to find the exit as quickly as possible. Especially now, since I don't have that lust for the boss. Which means I mm -hmm. might need to use two steals for the boss. What the fuck's the exit? Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, I got the lay of the land pretty well. So I can start blasting these guys now. Thankfully, most of the annoying stuff here is just sound-based aggro. Then again, the main problem with the last set is that you may be forced to kill those mobs. Since there are no other mobs. We'll see how this goes. I have a real good feeling about this run. And in the last three runs, We've, we've made it to 190 every single time we get past 180. I, I believe this is the run. I have faith. but don't really want to unless I have to. Let's just keep killing nades. Fuck, I'm gonna be so happy if this is finally the run.
kind of want to move to the exit room as soon as I can. Can't really deal with these sprites. It's close. And you can always just... Nate, Nate you can face tank. So you don't need any room to juke. I mean, you need to have some cooldowns in order to face tank them, but you can face tank them nonetheless. If this guy just stopped critting me, that'd be nice. Right, it seems like we're starting with the good old classic 10 kill floor as floor 1. Spent 12 minutes in the first floor. It's such a classic. Is this the first floor? Yeah, it is. <laughs> as soon as I enter the palace, my mind just focuses on the current floor I'm in. I completely lose track. <sighs> yeah, 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 yeah. Of course, it's gonna be one of these flaws. Now I need to do some backtracking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's still better than what we got last time. Because last time I got here, the first floor. This was like the starting room, and this this here would be a treasure room. That, that's how the last run started, so... Th this is much better already. As long as I don't hit that legendary worm treasure room. Which has not happened to me so far. Which means it might happen in this run. I mean, I kind of have an idea how to deal with it. You kind of need to approach it slowly and let them do that sand pillar attack one by one. Then you wanna witching the whole room. And then get through it while they are turned into animals and can't use sand pillars to on you. Or just run through the room and die and resurrect. That's always another choice. Yeah, there goes my second serenity. That's not good. Yeah, I think we're gonna kill these guys. I kind of want a fortune up. Fuck it, let's do it. Since I really, really need another serenity now. I really hate having one Serenity. But for this floor, yeah. There's no way. I mean, I could have Rage to this floor, but I don't want to use my Rages this early. I want to save them for the last three floors. Okay, why is every single enemy critting me all of a sudden? Please stop. getting so many bronze chests here. I want gold ones. Of course we're gonna get poison dust at <laughs> Let's 
Seriously, can these mobs stop critting me? <sighs> kind of wanna kill these guys. Kind of not. Fuck it, let's go for it. Of course that doesn't hit. These are fine as long as you can juke them. Since basically their only double auto attack is that cannonball plus normal auto attack. That's why they're dangerous for melee. But if you can just run circles around them, you're fine. Also, if your health gets really low. Out range DPS, you can just root them in the place and heal up in peace. Just be careful, they can still shoot cannonballs when they're rooted. But that's about it. Bit worried about time since I don't have lost. That's why I fortune up. I'm really hoping I'm gonna get lost from here somewhere. Since I can pretty much kill the boss in exactly eight minutes with lost, and I don't want to double steal the boss. Using st two steals for the boss. Yeah. That's gonna be really bad for the last set. Since having steals is pretty much everything in the last set. Okay, that's good. Too bad I didn't get anything with my fortune. I think I might fortune up the next floor as well, since I really need those serenities. I'm actually gonna do a little bit of exploring here and see what I can find. Since I'm only a little bit behind. Okay, that's that's worth exploring. As long as I don't hit mimics. The good old famous words, as long as I don't hit mimics, I'm fine. Yeah, there we go. I could go there, but yeah, that that's just gonna take way too much time. Yeah, you should always end up with three fortunes in the last. No, actually, I'm gonna save this one fortune. In case I hit up oh fuck, there are negative effects here. Damage dealt gloom. Yeah, I have steel. I... I kind of just have to deal with this. I can't use my last... Uh, serenity here. I need to save it for no item flow. I mean, if I had two serenities, it would I would use it instantly. Since damage jump plus gloom is such a time waste. I don't have any serenities to spare. Okay, maybe I should focus. I was thinking something. <laughs> I completely forgot, forgot I actually need to pay attention what these guys do. 
I can't just circle around them. <laughs> and spam random buttons. I actually need to pay attention whether it's Dragon's voice or Ram's voice. Oh well, I'm gonna fly some of the last floors and also rage some of them, so... I should be fine, e even if I get some time loss here. Then again, I would like to get at least one rage to the last set button. And maybe two flights as well. Since time is so tight in the last set. Well, there is some good luck in the fact that I have steel up. Yeah, resolution is nothing. Since these ice sprites are, uh, yeah, pretty much unkillable without steel, as ranged. Sprite, can you stop moving into the melee range? I'm pretty sure these have double auto with the melee range. Not 100% sure. But why else would they move so close? Maybe I should just check it out. Okay, they only have cast. Okay, then it's fine. Yeah, since these have cast, it doesn't really matter if you face tank them or not. Might need to use a witching here. <laughs> yeah, I have no healing cooldowns. <sighs> That's a bit too much damage for me, even with steel, with gloom. Oh well, it's only one witching then. Usually I have zero witchings here, so I'm already doing way better than normal. Let's not get hit by that. I'm pretty sure that freezes you into place and does a lot of damage. Yeah, it should do that. Yeah, I've gotten hit by these guys in heaven on high, I'm pretty sure. This is such a time waste flow, I hate it. Of course that doesn't open the can, why would it? Let there at least be something good here. Okay, my witching back, that's... yeah, it's kind of good. Come sprite. We want smooth in order for me to dance. If this is gonna be more than six kills this floor. Oh damn. I hate when you get a lot of time loss early on into the set. I like to be ahead before the later flows. So I have some time to waste in those flows. <sighs> of course, and I have no healing cooldown, so let's kill this thing. And 
hope we hit no traps. Can you actually arm slank these guys? Oh, you can. Nice. Question is which way is this thing facing? Oh great, we get to kill this thing as well. Now the main problem here is if this thing doesn't open the can, we kind of need to wait for respawns. Or use a witching, since, yeah, you can't kill crawlers. Or I need to use the witching right here. Fuck me. Oh, my steel ran out! I didn't know this. Yeah, of course I need to use a witching on this thing. Now it all makes sense. Please don't be a mimic, or if this doesn't open the can, please be a mimic. Okay, strength is good, strength is good. Now let's get the hell out of here. This was resolution, I'm pretty sure. Uh, which way are you looking that way? Okay. Now we just need to hope that this crawler doesn't walk into me. Since even though their sound aggro, they will aggro you if you walk into them. Okay, give me good floor with good music, please. Oh, these guys! Fuck it, let's go! These guys hit like a truck. But thankfully, they're part of mobs you can just... Oh, that was bad timing. I was gonna say, they're part of the family of mobs you can just hide, but... The thunderbite still hurts. Okay, you kind of need healing cooldowns for these guys. Or steel. Okay, lesson learned. We're not fighting any more Arcos House unless we have to. Thankfully, these guys are coming here. These guys are super easy. They just have telegraphs, that's it. I don't even know why my health got it there. I mean, they might hit you with an auto attack if you get unlucky. Like there, if you have no hiding room. I just need there to be something real good in that gold chest, and I'm fine. I mean, I'm only like six minutes behind, so... I'm actually not behind at all. If we say I rage through one floor, it's gonna take like, what, a minute? So that's a five minute time save. I really need there to be flight, strength, or steel here. 
Or Serenity. Serenity is really good as well. Yeah, I'll, I'll take that. Yeah, I forgot I was low on Serenities. Question is what I'm gonna kill next. This out of the question for now. Let's play it safe and walk. I still have no clue how sound based aggro enemies don't aggro you if you use skills. Okay, that was a bit close there. make a lot of sense, but fuck it. Then again, this world has ma magic and shit, so... Please open the can. Well, now I can at least check what's in here. I might need to go this for Rukamba. Whatever it's called. Since I can't kill this without steel. Yeah, we're killing this thing. And the main problem is I don't have much a room to work with, but. I should be able to manage it, right? Which way that sprite's looking? Yeah. Fuck, I forgot about the worms! Please don't kill me, sir. Please don't kill me. 0 0.2, 0 0.2, let's go. Okay, fuck it. That's it for the easy enemies. kill one of these. I might actually just just use a witching for this thing. Sense. Yeah, I don't I don't have any of my healing cooldowns up. And I don't want to wait for them. I mean, even with witching this thing, it's like a truck. And here we get the age old question can I kill it in time? <laughs> Even during the witching? And then so is. Nope. Oh, thank god the can opened. Okay, I'm five minutes behind. Five minutes behind is fine. It's fine. I just need to get one lost from somewhere and I should be okay. Let's actually grab this. I wanted to check that chest, but let's grab this patrol before it gets... Oh shit. <laughs> we might be in trouble, depends on where this thing is going. Oh, it's coming here, of course it's coming here. The thing is, I'm not sure if this room is large enough to avoid it or not. Oh well. It's time to find out. You're gonna go left or right? Center? Okay, this... this way. Hopefully I can kill this thing so fast that I can get this gone as well. 
thankfully it's quite slow moving. After this, we're gonna check if that's a mimic or not. This should be the last of the patrols. You usually have between three and six patrols, I think. I mean, if you get unlucky, you could get more. Or you can get zero. Yeah, it's not three to six, it's zero to six, actually. You can get no patrols at all. Let there be something good in here. Oh, it's a mimic. It's a good thing I waited before I opened this thing. Now the problem is, I'm already behind on time. Oh, well, I start spamming shit after the next floor anyways. plan for this set is at 186 affluence alteration if you get mandagora clear it normally if you don't just rage through it and then do it again and then oh, fuck me I'm almost dying because I'm talking again. Every time I start to talk, I almost die. <laughs> Thankfully, I was prepared for this shit right here. Alright, let's focus this time. I mean, Mimics won't get past your auto healing of sustains unless they crit you or you forget to uh, apply the sustain as soon as it goes off cooldown. That's the only situation they might kill you. I got so scared when I saw that treasure room. I was like, oh shit. Not this shit again. Actually, I gained some time. I did this floor in five minutes. There we go. What we're dealing with? Worms, claws, dragon. Alright, here's the thing. We might need to rage through this floor, actually. Because I'm not seeing a lot of things I can kill in here. We'll see, let's see what we've attacked before I jump into conclusions. I mean, getting past the dragon and claw is gonna be tough. Yeah, 
Yeah, let's just rage through this. Getting through this room is gonna be tough anyways. Now with good luck this opens the can. Oh fuck. I thought I could take the Mantico form into the next set. I mean I still might. We'll see. Yeah, there we go. Run! This loading screen is gonna fuck me over, isn't it? I'm gonna lose it during this loading screen. Yeah, there we go. Oh well, I got Mandagor room anyways. Fuck yeah. Strength is nice, but I kind of need a steal for the worms. <sighs> is there anything I can kill in here? I mean, I guess the worms are... I mean, I do have one extra raising, so... I can take the risk with worms and see if I can kill them. They're not actually too bad. I mean, I do have some time constraints, but... Push comes to shop, I still have two rages. We should be getting the enrage any second now. Or can I kill this before enrage? No, I can't. Let's check that chest. My main worry right now is I have no idea how long the boss takes without lust. Okay, extra affluence is always nice. Now this room here is a bit of a problem since it has flood dragons. So I kind of have to just play the waiting game here. <laughs> These worms here are the only mobs I can kill. Nice. And even then I need to lure through this room. to kill them. This this has been a, a good run in the sense that I've gotten over my fear of worms. Since I used to fear these guys, but right now I'm saying, yeah, these are not too bad. It's 
kind of hoping that would open the can, but... Oh well, thankfully I still have one worm here. If this worm doesn't open the can, I'm kind of fucked. But, I mean, not fucked, I, I just need to use another rage in here. Juke these guys using that thing. Okay, that opened it nice. Oh, more dragons! Nice game, nice game. <sighs> if this guy would just turn, I could probably juke through here. Or maybe I should just go here. And wait for this and this to turn away. Oh, don't come this way, please. Stop, stop. Thank you. Oh, come on with your bullshit dragons. Why is this dragon not moving at all? Like, I might need to just suicide to that. Exit. What's the turn order here? If this guy turns, I'm fucked. There we go, I'm suiciding. I think I'm just gonna rage through this floor now. Oh yeah! Oh, 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 oh yeah, we're raging through this. Uh, please don't be a fucking mimic. Oh, it's a resolution. Uh, I need a side here, I don't know where the... Oh, the exit's right here. So let's start... Let's check this before we start raging. Just with some good luck, I can take the rage to the next floor. Can this miss, by the way? <laughs> with blind? <laughs> I actually don't know. Oh, I fucked up! I fucked up big time. I was supposed to use the flight before I go into Mandico mode. Fuck! Because if I had flight, this duration might be enough for this floor. Because without the flight, it's... I can already tell it's not gonna be enough. can go straight to this guy. I was hoping I don't hit any lurings, but there we go. It might actually... Why did I witch there? It might just be better to die here. I panicked! <laughs> oh well. We're dying in this room. Now the question is, do I wait out? the rest sickness or not. I'm pretty sure I can handle Garms with rest sickness on. 
Maybe I'll wait a minute of it. I mean, the problem here is I have no idea how long the boss takes without lust. And with lust, it's pretty much exactly 8 minutes. So unless I find another steel here, it's depo steel. But I might get another rage into the next set. That's that's kind of good if I can manage that. Whew. If that was another luring, that yeah, I would have been done for. I mean, it was kind of good that I hit that luring there, anyways, because I got some extra kills of my rage because of it. And now I sh should be able to clear this floor pretty easily. Yeah, 12 seconds to a sickness I can pull this guy. Unless he crits me, of course. As far as item setups go, this is pretty damn good for the last set because I have three flights and one rage. The only main problem is I'm gonna be heading with one steel unless I won't find one in here since I probably need to use two steels for the boss. have time to check this chest. Any further chests? Yeah, I'm not dealing with this one. I'm fine even if it's a mimic. Okay, okay. This is, this is good item setup. I'm happy with this. I'm happy with this. I finally am heading to the last set with one rage. That has been my dream for a long time. Now I just need to watch out that I don't die in this boss. Um, I'm... Let's just head to the boss room. But I'm thinking I'm gonna... Um, I'm gonna wait a bit here. Before I do this boss. Sense. My super potions are cooled down. I'm gonna wait for that. Since even without last, I should be able to do this in 10 minutes. There's no way this is gonna take more than 10 minutes. I mean, I'm gonna engage at 10 minute mark. That should, in theory, give me enough time to get my super potions back. For the time I need them. I'm waiting for 90 seconds. Ah, that's gonna be a bit risky, so I'm gonna engage pretty soon. Let's see how it goes. I should need only second pin and curing balls until I get to the sap cycle. This boss does. So unlike the first time I ever fought, let's actually activate both steel and strength. Yeah, there's the 10 minute mark, let's let's just go for it. The main thing with this boss is you need why I waited for the potions is uh, you need one healing 
Oh, that was a bit close. You need one healing for each scouting. He does. And with Dancer, you always need to have either second wind curing wall or potion up. Oh, you are absolutely fucked. And it's really strict. Sometimes. I mean, for example, right now I don't need to do, but if he had crit hit me, I probably should have used the cooldown. going into a dance right after scouting <laughs> since I can't use my healing cooldowns while dancing oh well let's actually see how much she see how long this takes without lust I mean, with good RNG, I might, I just might be able to do this without refreshing my steel. Next should be the big burst. Oh, that's good luck. Nice. Yeah, let's not go and dance before I can do rehabilitation. Even though I sustained a bit late here, since this boss should be spamming just saps right here. And one more sap, yeah, there we go. Let's actually do this since I'm a bit off with my healing potions. here because the lava bomb is about to spawn <laughs> wait for the auto attack so I don't push it too far away yeah the amount of times in the 80 version that I accidentally just push the bomb away with dance is just too damn high yeah, I need to double heal here actually Forty-four percent, and we are a little over four minutes thirty seconds. <sighs> it's gonna be so close whether I need to respawn the steel, refresh the steel or not. Fuck. I'm gonna refresh the steel when it has. Uh, Ten seconds left. Uh, yeah, that should be enough time for me to deal with whatever this boss throws at me. But I finally did it. I have one rage for the last set. 
which has never happened before. And three serenities, three flights, one resurrection, two sides, three safeties. I I should be fine unless I absolutely fuck up in the last set somehow. Should be sap here, right? Sap. There we go. <laughs> now the main thing here is gonna be, can I head into the next set with two steals or not? It's it's starting to look like no, I need to refresh the steal on this bus. I mean, if I really wanted to play it risky, I could have used my Tincture, but... If I get crit by scouting, I need a super potion for that. Last plane. There we go. Oh, that was way too close. <laughs> and that right there is why we don't dance when the lava bomb is about to spawn. Alright, ah, 10%, 34 seconds, <sighs> yeah, I'm pretty sure I won't be able to make it, I'm not gonna risk it. I mean, in theory, I, it really depends when that still ends whether or not I can survive without it. Like... Yeah, we should be getting Lava Bomb next. So, I think I'm actually gonna risk it. Fuck it! I'm gonna get extra steel to the next set. Yeah, we're getting two steals, there we go. 7 minutes 58 seconds. You can just and just do it with one steal, one strike if you don't have a lust. Okay, that's good. That's really fucking good. Whew. That one bomb I danced away, that scared the shit out of me. Since it started doing the cast right away.